I am Anil Kumar and here is a very interesting question on quadratic equations. A large fountain located in a park has 35 water jets. One of the streams of water follows a parabolic path so that its height is given by the equation h equals to minus 2x square plus 6x plus 5 where h meters is the height of the stream of water at any distance x meters from its jets. What is the maximum distance the water jet can reach? Round it to the nearest tenth of a meter. That is the question. Now I have picked up this question from the test paper and uh, what I notice is that in the test paper the student has found the maximum height and has got the full marks. But I think it should be read as height of the stream of the water at it says the question here is let's read that part one of the streams of the water follows a parabolic path so that its height is given by this equation where h meters is the height of the stream of the water at any distance x meters from its chest so x is the distance right and says what is the maximum distance the water jet can reach rounded to nearest tenth of meter so yes fountains normally shoot upwards right so we are normally interested in the height of a fountain but since the question is saying what is the maximum distance and x is the distance we should be finding the maximum distance right not the height so that is why I have taken up this question and I am not sure whether I am right or wrong but that's what I feel now let's look into it once again so what we have here is let's say this is the fountain right so this fountain has a parabolic path so we'll say kind of it starts from 5 so it's kind of like this right okay. so that point where it hits the ground where the height is again 0 is the maximum distance so that is the value this is the maximum distance we should be talking about correct so at that point height will be 0 therefore at maximum distance uh, let me write like this at maximum distance which I am saying x in meters height equals to 0 right and therefore we will write 0 for height in the given equation which is 2x square plus 6x plus 5 and then find the answer correct now we can use the quadratic formula right so or we could also probably factor let's use the quadratic formula and find the answer so in this particular case x is equals to minus b which is let me write down the quadratic formula first for you and then we'll use it so we have x equals to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2 times a right so minus of 6 we have minus 6 plus minus square root of 6 square minus 4 times a is minus 2 times 5 divided by 2 correct so we can use the calculator to find this answer which is minus 6 plus minus square root of uh, let's use the calculator we know one thing minus and minus becomes plus so we'll just add them up right so we have 36 square so let me do square root 6 square plus since this minus and minus becomes uh, plus 4 times 2 times 5 is uh, 40 but like 4 times 2 times 5 equals 2 that gives us 2 square root 19 in decimals it is okay so it was okay let me write 2 square root 19 divided by 2 first right and then what we got is the decimal value minus 6 plus minus 8.717 divided by 2 okay so distance should be positive right not negative distance and therefore we will take the positive distance and we'll take away 6 from this we say minus 6 equals to divided by 2 equals to so the answer is approximately 1.35 right so what I did was I took minus 6 plus 8.717 divided by 2 since the distance cannot be negative right and that gave me let me write down here 
So when you do this, you get 2.717 divided by 2 using calculator I got 1.358 and then the answer is nearest tenth of a meter so that means 1.4 meters so that is the maximum distance as our answer which is here 1.4 meters correct so I think that should uh, be the answer for this question and we're not really looking for the maximum height as you know this is 5 for us in this graph. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.